So here's a common uh, hitting warm up. And maybe you guys just shag for three balls, we'll just shag them up. So this is what's no good about this. The coach is tossing perfect, which you never see a perfect pass from a coach in a game. We got the middle already standing 15 feet. We got the outside hitters off the court already. And this is how we're gonna warm up hitting. So we'll take a couple swings. And this can be okay. So I got a perfect pass with a coach. Okay, so there's almost nothing I like about what we just did there. So we had a coach toss perfect. The hitters were already in transition. The middle never stands in the middle of the court. They're already out here. So now let's fix this. So we get the balls coming in from a player here. We're gonna transition our attack each time. So we're gonna have our left front have to come off the net. The middle has to come off the net. So you'll start on that side of the net. Uh, yeah, just step under until it's your turn. And then we'll put a block up. Now we have three defensive players and we're gonna have our players run the drill. So what this does is I can coach now. I don't, I don't have to toss balls. We have assistant coaches that can coach defense. So now we're gonna see a little bit what we can do with our group with the players initiating the drill and our libero will pass it and we'll run from there, okay? And we go. So this can be a hitting warm up. We're getting the same amount of swings now as if I was standing there coaching, the, coaching, but we're having transition, we're having action, we're having defense. So here's be my contention, is that we just got as many swings there as if I stood here as a coach and tossed the ball because our players are good enough to keep the tempo of the drill up. And if you, te if you teach your players to run a drill, and I just met these kids, so it's pretty cool they're, they're adapting quickly, but they're keeping the tempo of the drill up so then the coaches can coach, and we can give feedback, and we can have a defensive coach, and I can watch our setter, but I'm not preoccupied with doing all the work myself, throwing the balls in, and they've got this going. This is pretty good. Now, what we want by design is our libero here to pass the ball out of system and make it hard for our setter. So our, we're gonna pass the ball by design, maybe over here, make it hard for the setter. And then on our middle attack, Sid, maybe we put it like kind of bad, but not real bad, but for the outside hitters, you can really spray it. So we play most of the game out of system and most of the game scrambling. So now we're gonna do our hitting warm up, and then we'll do this with an out of system by design. All right, let's see that. Yep, next ball in pretty quick. Out of system, and you can push her out of system. Now we'll kind of keep it a little out of system for the middle. Okay, now, really out of system here. Let's really make the setter work. Yep, so she's got to get comfortable. So this is a hitting warm up, but instead of just doing a hitting warm up with the coach tossing, we're getting some action in.